Hello, 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 and welcome to episode two of the Gunslinger. I do have to apologize right off the bat. I am about three minutes further down the road than we were when we left off in episode one. Had a little bit of problem with the beginning recording of this video. For those of you who are joining us for the first time, we are playing as Lady Jaxi, a Asmodian Technus. And the Technus class moves into being the Gunslinger when they ascend. Now we just introduced ourselves to Ulgon, the Raider boss. And let's see, excellent, I like your spirit, I'm Elgon, Elgon, the boss around here, and I hope you're ready to get your hands dirty. Okay, that looks good. Could I get some goodies out of this? Um, ah, okay, so we had completed a quest, I guess. So the only weapon there is the thief's pistol. That's a pistol for us. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and track all of these. I guess we can't track those yet. We picked up a bunch of new campaigns here. As you can see, we finished Order of the Captain, which was to introduce ourselves. And now we have Thinking Ahead, Where's Ray, Treasure of the Deceased, and a Charmed Cube. We also have two quests that we're working on. So, let's go over and talk to Taboo. As you can remember from last time, we need to drop off the paperwork with him. You must be the messenger Vanar sent, am I right? Hand me the reports, then. Let me see if I can decipher the idiot's handwriting. Here they are, plus fruit from Vanar. Uh, he thinks he can charm me with a fruit basket? I'm an Algorn Raider. I have no desire for such softness as fruit baskets. Listen closely, Technist. You do well to distance yourself from that fool. Vinar can talk, but he's a coward and gets no respect from the others. If you want to make it as a Raider, you need to display loyalty, grit, and ability. There's a good reason we stuck Vanar way out in the Alden Basin. Anyway, thank you for the reports. I'll pass on whatever Algar needs to see. Okay. So I took care of that. Who else we gotta go talk to? There's somebody up here. Lots of people here at the camp. Ah! Bakarak, the cube artisan. Shugos always know a good deal. Hello, hello. You have cube, yes? Bakarak can expand for you. Make bigger on inside than appears. Ark, ark. Powerful magic. Nine more slots. And Shugo's in pandemonium can do much more. Costs, though. Costs much more. Yes, yes it does. Okay. Level 3, new quest. The shinier the better. First, let's expand our cube. It's going to cost us 980 canar. Well, that's okay. Come back again. You're our cube just got bigger. Pretty cool. While we're here, gray, gray, grays, all these grays. Hey, we got a sword. Well, that does us no good. Let's equip our new gun. Okay. Shugos always know a good deal. Let's see what the quest is. Come closer, Technist. Bakalak has a job for you. I am a cube maker. Finest magical cubes. Bigger on the inside than on the outside. Very important. Ak, ak. However, old cubes need tending also. Bakarak can restore their luster and beauty. 
even the boss has given me his cube to repair. Very important job. To make best job of it, highest quality oils required. If you don't help get them, Bakarak will make sure wise Algoron knows why his cube looks strap. Ak ak. <laughs> don't threaten me, Shugo. No, no, a thousand no's. Bakarak did not mean it, brave technist. Merely want the cube to be as luxurious as possible. Ak ak. Need slink oil. Slinky slinks are near Lake Tenpar. Please help me, Technus. No way a tiny sugar like me can hunt a slink. Bakarak would have trouble with a cuckoo. Okay, I'll accept that quest. Okay, and remember slink oil. Alright, on my way. Take care. Nurk, nurk. Nurk, nurk. Ark, ark. Nurk, nurk. Nano, nano. Sorry. I think I just dated myself. <laughs> oh well. Okay, Manu. What's Manu want? A fine day. Hello there, Technist. Fancy a quick duel? Ha! <laughs> Is that fear in your eyes? Don't worry. I ain't got time to spare right now. Too much training to dole out. So, what brings you to Manu after your skill manual? Okay. New skill... What happened? Nothing happened. Well, that's weird. Oh well. Let's buy a couple skill manuals. For your level 3 or higher, we'll buy that one. Level 3 or higher? Oh, wait. I don't want warriors. Get rid of those. Okay, on person. Blood for blood. Blood for blood. Don't want a skill. There's my trainer. Why was it sending me the wrong trainer? That's weird. Technus instructor. Welcome, friend. Okay, actually, I do need to learn a new skill. Ah, that's too bad. Well, certainly I have the skill manuals you need. Come back if you want to chat about the tech, though. Okay, okay. And let's buy some manuals. Welcome, friend. There we go. That's much better. Technus level 3. Technus level 5. Technus level 7. Do I buy Technus level 9? Hmm. Sure, why not? Leaving so soon. Let's make sure my inventory is set up right. Okay, so he's gonna get moved down here. Okay, first off I can use that one, so we'll go ahead and use it. Learned a new skill. Okay, seven, nine, five. Now what skill do we learn? We learned gunshot. Inflicts 189 magical fire damage on a target within 200 meters. I'm sorry, 20 meters of you. Okay. Get down there. Put auto attack. Put auto attack up there. So we got two main shots here. 130 and 189. 16-second cooldown and a two-second cooldown. Okay, that works. Who else has something in here for us? This person over here. Ryan Wanderer. What's up? I will 30 through 50 new quest. Bro brotherly love. Have you been to the Fast Track server? Are you going there? Do you know my brother, Nolan? Heh, 
I should probably slow down and explain, right? Well, we used to manage a fast track server together, but then we fought. Well, we always fought, but this time it seemed bigger than all the other times. Now, I can't even remember what it was about. Stupid, huh? Well, I'd like to find out if he's still mad at me. If you get the chance, will you go to go and ask him? It's easy to get there, just go to menu. Okay, so this is our little tutorial on how to get to the fast track server. Which I had forgot about doing, and we definitely do need to do that. So, let us go to fast track server. Move. And we're off. Now, in the fast track server, there are certain skills you can't use. Specifically, you cannot trade here. I'm not sure what else, but I know for a fact you cannot trade on the fast track server. Okay, let's see. Brotherly love is in progress. Welcome and all that. The fast track server offers you the shortcut to success. Get experience here in peace without the hassle. Sorry, I know I'm a bit half-hearted about my speech, but Ryan was the one who always used to do that. I'm no good at people. Oh, funny you should mention Ryan. He wants to know if I'm still mad at him? Well, should I be? Ugh, he was always so childish. I suppose he's fishing for an apology. I don't know what I've got to apologize for. Okay, so we either want a... Attack speed becomes faster by 3% for 5 minutes or casting speed. We want casting sp No, we want attack speed. Yeah. Okay. Okay, swallowing pride. Fine, you can tell Ryan something from me. Say that I'd like him to behave like an adult for once and talk to me in person instead of sending a messenger. In case you're not sure how to get back, and yeah. To get back to the regular server to go talk to Ryan, we just go to channel, go to standard, standard server. And as you can see here on the standard server, you cannot play with the characters on the fast track server. Are you sure you want to move? And if you move to the fast track server, you can play with the characters in other servers, but not with those in the current server. In addition, you may not be able to use some functions including direct trade in the fast track server. Yeah. Okay, so let's go back to the standard server. All the quests outside of this one with bro brotherly love, all the quests are the same. Not exactly sure. I don't remember offhand. Let me see. Does it say on here? Just see real quick. No. I'd have to look into that a little bit more. I'm not sure what level it is. But basically up to a certain level. I guess it's up to level 50 you get extra XP on the fast track server. What did Nolan say? Can I go home to the fast track server where I belong and be partners with my brother again? It's really all I want. Nothing's been quite the same since I left, but it's just too humiliating yeah, to grovel. Yeah, Nolan wants you to go in person, dude. Oh, he thinks I'm childish, does he? Well, fine. See if I care. Uh, wow, I just really proved his point, didn't I? Uh, fine. I 
got a lot of growing up to do. And grown-ups know how to apologize and blah, blah, blah. If it means I can have things back to normal, I guess I'll go see him. Don't tell him or anything. I need to work up my nerve. Okay. Picked up quite a bit of Kenya just for doing those little errands. And the couple of seconds it took to switch between servers. And now we'll move back to the fast track server. I highly recommend people picking up this quest. Like I said, it gives you over 6,000 Kenya, which is nothing to laugh at in the beginning of this game. Okay. Now we got a quest over here with Erd. Have you business with me? And Erd basically wants to yell at us about nobody having any respect for their elders. And let's see, she knows my name. And what does she want us to do? Need the materials for a something, so we need Blackbeak Aeons. Basically, we gotta go back down to Lake Tarnapah again. Everything happens down there at the beginning of this game. We'll accept that. May Ion protect you. Yeah. I would appreciate a little bit of feedback. I've had a couple of people tell me they don't like me reading the quest. So I'm trying not to read the ones like with hers and, you know, some of the other lesser quests. Um, Can't you see I'm busy? That's pretty much how I play. So I'd like to know, do you think I should read them? Do you think I should read any? What's your feel on this? Let me know in the comments below if you like the reading, if you like the voice acting, and if you don't, I would love to hear from you. And let's see, he's got a job for us. On the shore northeast of Lake Tunapre are a few sprig dens. If you look around a bit, you should find plenty of grain sacks. We need to go steal the grain from the sprigs. But won't the sprigs starve? Now don't you worry about the sprigs. A hungry spring sprig gathers food even faster. Call it motivation. Okay. Oops. I'm tracking everything here. That's what I was afraid of. Okay. This dude's got a quest. Ion has led you here. I can't believe I'm go going to get the blame again. I wish Buckar were here. I'd ring his neck. We sent him out to the sap farm a few weeks ago. His laziness was getting intolerable here. He's a sort who won't lift a finger unless you see it right behind him and scream in his ear. Not exactly the Asmodian way, huh? I'd go yell at him again, but I've got too much out here to do. Okay. Heard your Venar is lackey for a while. Glad to see you moved on. That Venar is useless. Sitting there in his tent and Curse in the darkness. Is it true he sent Taboo a fruit basket? <laughs> Not exactly the sort of gift a real raider like Taboo appreciates. Anyway, Lady Jaxie, the best way to earn some prestige with us and catch Algorn's eye is to volunteer. There's always more thing there's always one more thing to do, eh? Huh? Yes, I see where you're going with this. What do you need me to do? Okay, so we gotta go deal with Mortgar and convince him to get back to work. 
Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, one more thing down the road. I'm glad you're here. Two more things. Level 5 mission progress. Raider's Ray. Thanks, Zakel, you're here. You've got a seri we've got a serious problem. It's Ray, the boss's kid. She's missing, and we need to find her before Algarn does something rash. Yesterday she said she was going for a walk in the forest, and no one's seen her since. Nobody noticed until she did show up for breakfast. When I checked her room, I found a note on her bed. Said she wants to be a real raider, not just the boss's little girl. I showed the note to Algarn, and he turned positively pale. Well, has she disappeared before? Ah, uh, Ray's always put herself in harm's way and pestering us to take her along on raids. If we refuse, she tags along anyway. But the boss don't want this life for her. Algorn wants her to stay in camp, study her books, and make a better life for herself. But she's got radar blood, you know? You can see her father's glint in her eyes. Makes me kind of nervous. So she went to the Manaholi forest. Looks that way. She's probably just lost the forest, but with her knack of finding trouble, start by checking with Dabby. He's overseeing the tree sap extraction at the edge of the forest. If the kid headed that way, Dabby might have seen her. And hurry, Lady Jaxie. All Gord's pretty good at hiding his feelings. But it's only a matter of time before he does something drastic. On my way. Oh, you got another quest for us, do you? More, a little bit more about Ray and being a handful. And he needs a potion for his back. <coughs> yeah, sorry. I can't thank you enough. Okay. So. We gotta go fight a bunch of things down this way. Well, might as well collect some plants. Looks like I might fail. Yeah, I'm gonna fail this one. Wow. Collecting actually is a good way to build up experience in Aeon. If I actually succeed, you'll see what I mean. Here we go. I succeeded. I actually got 182 XP for succeeding. There's a web slank. Gotta kill those, a couple of those. That's an invalid target. So far I have been very happy with the gunslinger. She seems to be able to take and do a high amount of damage. And we just leveled up. Okay, got all those that we need. I'm gonna go find some grain. Here's another plant. Another 182 XP. And 
another 182 XP. So off that one plan, I got almost 600 XP. if I'm supposed to be shooting these things or not. I don't remember. I know I'm supposed to be getting grain. Oh, there's some gr bunch of grain. I got to that one before I did. We need one more grain. Don't think it's gonna be a problem. There we go. Three of three, those Orion wrist feathers. I oops Iron. Okay, so we need to find some flowers. Not flowers, some birds. Sorry, I was looking at the flowers. I think I should find them. <laughs> One bird down, two to go. Wow, lots of stuff off that bird. else going on down here? Looks like we got some quests over this way. That's the wrong target. The heck. Sure a couple more birds while I'm here. Aggie's dock. Now we get a little bit sappy. As for Lumbra, friend. As for Lumbra. Can never say it unless I'm looking at it. Loves in bloom, and did you know about the flowers? So you like the girl on the dock? Yeah, it's more beautiful than any flower. Well, give her a gift. The only thing fitting is a flower, but I can't get them. Can you get them? I'm on my Be way. Be careful. Well, there's one right there. How many of these flowers do we need? Three. We need three flowers for the bouquet. Where are 
today. Come on, one more flower. It's got to be here somewhere. There it is. Let's shoot a Brax, see how difficult it is to take one of those down. Uh, obviously not difficult at all. So far the Gunslinger, I'm sorry, Technus is a very good shot. <laughs> yeah. yeah, might as well go three for three while I'm standing here. Take him back his flowers. Yes, speak up. I've been standing here mulling over what I should do. Okay, well, these flowers do. These are perfect, really, truly perfect. I hope that she likes them. Okay. How are you? Yes, want? speak up. Oh, stop being such a coward. Um, do it yourself. Wait, what is he doing? But, but, no, I can't do it. I'm too scared. Please, you've got, you've helped me before. Will you help again? Just go to Deggy. And hand her the bouquet. Tell her that they're from me. Man, do it yourself, dude. You're right. I have to stop being such a wimp. The only one who can tell her how I feel is me. I can do this. I'm a grown man. Okay, I can do it. Yes, yes, I can. I'll go to her later tonight. Or tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow. Would be best. Or maybe the day I... Uh, good luck. May the darkness grant you peace. What else does he want? Yes, speak up. May the darkness grant you peace. Yeah, I yes, guess he has to up. actually do it himself. We gotta take him over for him. All right, fine, I'll do it. Ugh, I can't believe I'm doing this. May the darkness this. grant you peace. The advantage is ours. Are you one of the new raiders? I haven't seen you around here before. So what can? Well, here, this is for you. It's from uh, Bolar, right? He's about as subtle as a rampaging Brax. It took him months to actually say hello to me, and now this? I'm sorry, but I'm not interested in a guy who can't even summon the courage to speak to me directly. I'll take the bouquet, though. It was a nice gesture, after all. I understand. Okay, what else we gotta do out here? Back to Brax? Yeah. I'm sorry, Bolar. As for Lumbra, friend. Well, well, what did she say? Yeah, she liked the flowers, but... I see. What was I thinking? It's plainly obvious that a beauty like Nagy could never have a serious interest in me. He feels so stupid. Okay. <sighs> Where else do we gotta go? Here. So we gotta go back up and turn all these quests in, it looks like. Okay. Yeah, let me just make sure I got them all. Oh, I did mark off idle. Okay, so thinking ahead, gather some spring grain. Did that. Where's Ray? Don't want to talk to Dabby yet. Quest. The shinier the better. We got the slings. We got the plants. I'll talk to no Mutgar later. And we got the breast feathers. Good. We can head back up and turn these back in.
I'm glad you're here. Okay, oh, my back, oh, oh, my aching back, I need a massage. Oh, I do, did you find the Aspa herbs I asked for? I think so, here they are. Yes, these are perfect, good, give me my reward. Okay. Onward. Can't you see I'm busy? Yep, I get your grain. Oh, right, Lady Jaxie, kill some sprigs, did you? And more to the point, got the grain sacks. Hand them over. Those sacks need to be on the next caravan north to more settled lands. Three sacks, just as you asked for. Well done, I want you out there. You seem to be able to take a little punishment. Always a good trait for a raider. Too many city recruits can dish it out, but they can't take it. Even the Sprigs are starting to realize some of our guys aren't as tough as our veterans and Olgorn himself. They are getting aggressive, and there are so many of them that we'll be in trouble if we don't do something soon. We need the Sprigs to fear us once more. Ready for more raiding? <laughs> as you wish. As I wish? That's city talk from a raider. I expect to hear the task is mine. Or at least an on my way, followed by the sound of your footsteps. Let me say it like all Gorn would, and you can try again. Go back to the sprig dens around Lake Tonapray and kill six sprig gatherers in cold blood. So fear in destruction in your wake. Blood for blood. Yeah, on my way. Okay, got a couple more things over here. Gotta go take the Shugo his oil and the old lady her feathers. Have you business with me? I'll take it. You gathered all the feathers. Yes, will these feathers do? Yes, these will be more than adequate, young technist. I'll mention your name when Olgorn receives his finished product. Here, take this. Though my reward is small, take it as a sign of my gratitude, and maybe a glimmer of hope for your generation. Okay. Well, we leveled up again. Pretty cool. We're moving right up the chains. What are we now? Level 10? No, that's a bird. What are we? Where the heck am I? Ah, down here. Level 6. Bakarak is up here. Shugos always know a good deal. Okay, we'll give him his oil. Let him side up the boss's cube. Okay, let's go sell some stuff. Shugos can always help. Where's my sell all miscellaneous? There we go. And we need to sell that. Let's sell that. And that's, that's all for now. You got anything worth buying? Take an extraction tool. Two. Should we take some bandages too? Yeah, why not? Combination tool, enchantment stone combining tool. You can combine two enchantment stones in the combination tool to create a new enchantment stone. Nah, we're not gonna worry about that right now. Okay. Take care. Nyak nyak. That is our special cube for our quest items. And then this is our inventory. That's our running scroll. That's our courage scroll. What's that done? 
so it's an event scroll. Raises speed by 30% for 30 minutes. Hey, that's pretty cool. Okay. Let's go ahead and tune this so we know what it is before we sell it. Uh, looks like a normal sword to me. Oh well, no big deal. Oh cool, we can use this book. That's what those are. Oh, that's a minor life potion. That's a minor life elixir. Recovers the target's HP by 31 points every 2 seconds for 20 seconds. HP by 30 seconds. 7 points. So it's a little bit bigger. Okay. I'll socket some of those mana stones here in a bit. Actually, probably do that next time, because we've been playing now for 40 minutes. Kind of hard to believe we've been playing that long. Um, let me go make sure I am tuned here. Bio bound, bind, whatever. There we go. What do you want? I don't think I need healing. Well, let's check. Nope. Be careful. Okay. So we are done in this area. We're actually going to stop here for tonight. We've got quite a few quests done. And it's actually getting relatively late, so we are going to take and call it a night. It's actually first thing in the morning, but we'll guys stop here. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of The Gunslinger. This has been Sir Jaxie. If you need to find me at any point in time you're more than welcome to message me at any of the social media sites listed above i can be found at all of them as sir jaxi if you've liked this video please go ahead and like it below if you're not subscribed to our channel yet, then what are you waiting for go ahead and subscribe so we can notify you of when we've got new videos coming out the gunslinger is taken and posted here on YouTube every Friday. I also have another Aeon series that I'm doing called The Song Weaver, and that one is posted every Saturday. So, until next time, this is Sir Jaxie fading out.